Sunfish pocket. Kitchen window. This one's open. Nothing looks suspicious. Life preservers, oil drums. The capacity of this oil drum is 200 liters. It weighs approximately 44 pounds when empty. Let me check inside. Hmm. Oh, what is this? A watch? What? There's something inside. I stepped up to the drum. This is the oil drum. This is the kind of oil drum that has a lid, right? Yeah, Iba would know if there were stab wounds. Shoka was stabbed to death. Correct. Let's open it. It is a watch. This is... is it his watch? This is the wristwatch Renju always wore. It is. No doubt about it. But how did this get here? I think we've checked everything we need to. I agree. We should compile our evidence and inferences. Mizuki, you ready to leave? What? But we aren't done investigating. I never talked to Mizuki, did I? What do you mean? There are still people I want to talk to. Well, all right then. Um, Like the police? No? Oh, or do you just mean you? All right. Uh, do you want to talk to Oda? <laughs> Oda is in here all the time. He might know something. I'll call him. Ota's phone is broken. He dropped it in a puddle. Sounds like Ota. He's so clumsy. <laughs> We'd have to talk to him in person. Why are the causes of death different? Are the two killers? Well, it's not so much the cause of death that's the, the trademark here. It's, it's the stealing of the eye. He's right? probably at Lemna Skater Matsushita Diner. Hmm. One or the other, huh? Same sounds like him. Do you want to talk to Iris? Yeah. Daddy owned Lemniscate and Iris works for them. She used to work here too. So she, she might did. Something. Oh, that's interesting. I'll call her. Mizuki tried calling Iris, but there was no answer. Hmm. Have any idea where she might be? I don't know. Iris is into a lot of things. Well, interesting. Any other places you could think of? Well, there is one place. Have you heard of Golden Yokocho in the Entertainment District? Daddy used to go to a place called Marvel a lot. Maybe they know something about him. Hmm. All right, then. Let's head out. Lemniscate, Matsushita Diner, and Marvel. Let's head out. Okay. All right, let's go. Not much else for us to do here. Nice! We actually have options as to where to go. Let's start with going to the diner. Let's let's go talk to Oda. I'm kind of interested to hear his take on things and see how things are going. Also, I figure he might be the most annoying person to talk to, so let's get this out of the way first. Hello, welcome. You're Mizuki, right? Oda's friend? Yep. And you... Oh, I suppose I should introduce myself more formally. At least something a little more than flashing your badge. Yeah, seriously, dude. My name is Kaname Date. Mr. Date, what can I help you with? Okay, uh, well, first, Mizuki, have you been here before? Yeah, I am friends with Oda. I've been here a few times. All right, fine. Uh, Eli, they give it the follow. Kuroda Kazuaki Shin Meat Pickled in Miso. What is wrong with this restaurant? Yeah, that doesn't sound that good. Salt, pepper, a blend of red cayenne and spices, and an unidentified liquid. It says fermented Mayumi juice. Oh! Oh no. None of us can figure out what the juice is. Disposable chopsticks. Photo. Family photo. Swinging door. A singing door. God, not again. A swinging door. Oh, don't do this again. Please, for the love of God. Oh, a bucket. Man, I really want to put that bucket on your head and smack it with a mop handle. What the fuck? Why? The 
freaking hell! It's rude! Flash the badge, respect the badge! Beer cases. The door. A table. Low table. Cushions. A riddle. Oh. What is the difference between a cushion and you, Date? Fermented Miami juice? Is that like Gamer Girl bathwater? <laughs> I hope not. I don't know. What? Nothing. You're both soft and get thrown around. I'm gonna fucking rip you out of my own head in a minute, Iba. That wasn't bad. I'm getting better with the jokes. It's November. It still says January. Even the year's wrong. This is old. Hands off those hands. Oh, God damn it! not again. <laughs> Just kidding. Didn't she say the same thing yesterday? Yes, she did. She did. Not unlike Mayumi. Oh. Small sitting cushion. Da window. Da fortune. Da foe. Poster. Hey, Dante, beer ads. why do beer ads always have girls in bikinis in them? Because they know their target demographic, Mizuki. Because they make you thirsty. No. Oh, oh, oh. Why? I'll tell you when you're older. <laughs> oh, God. More menus. Just want to look around before we actually get into the nitty gritty here. A cordless ring, phone. Ring, ring, ring. Well, the phone's ringing. Are you going to pick it up? No, it isn't. <laughs> It's a fridge. What else we got here? The kitchen. Hmm. Oh, hello there, poster. Autographs. Oh, it's Nasabo from that band Magnuspiel. Magnuspiel? I have no idea who that is. Yeah, I have absolutely no clue. Here's the real answer. The boobs. Yeah, they're happy. Huh. <laughs> You're looking gorgeous today. Oh, stop, you charmer. I mean, hot rooms make you thirsty and hot days do the same. Clearly hot girls work in the same way, right? Yeah, there you go. You found out the secret to marketing, Neo Bullseye. But you're not getting a discount out of me. I Damn knew it. you were a pedo, Dante, but I didn't think you were a cougar hunter, too. Girl. <laughs> Bruh. What the fuck? I'm getting a real sense of deja vu with you. I am neither of those things. Zero filter on this girl. Where is your husband? I completely forgot. I wonder where he got off to. But he'll come back soon. Your husband dead. He always does. Runs off, then comes back. I feel like you, you have Alzheimer's or something. I'm beginning to have doubts about the management of this establishment. Seriously? As well. Is Oda here? He went out early this morning. I don't know where. I see. Nope. Business card. Sorry to be Dang, a bother. Mizuki have a fierce Oda attitude. Back. Can you tell him <laughs> to contact me? Oh, well, sure. Thanks, ma'am. Okay. Got it. Date, let's go somewhere else. I have a friend that's really good at holding water. We call him Adam. Oh, a uh, damn. Oh, fucking hell. I almost went over my head. Yeah, let's go. Alright, well, I guess nothing to do here. Any recommendations? Oh, everything here is delicious. But my personal favorite is our omelet rice. Did you want to eat here? No, I don't have much of an appetite. How's your stuff? Same. I don't think I can eat right now. Well, considering what you've been through, I'm not too surprised. Let's see if we can go find Iris now, I suppose. Maybe Oda's here too. Yeah, why do I have a bad feeling about Oda? I know, right? Well, I, I don't necessarily have a bad feeling, but I get, a, I get a weird feeling from him. Like, he's more involved than we think he is. I don't think he's a killer, but... It is weird. What? Hey there, handsome. Hi, boobs. I mean, uh, ma'am. Excuse me? I cannot even right now. Do tell. Hold on. Give me just one sec. Mizuki, do you know this guy? Uh, yeah. 
Can you introduce me, please? Well, hello there, lady. She is surprisingly unprofessional for a receptionist. Come on, it's just not so bad. Okay, I gotta, I gotta stop. I gotta stop, or GGK will disown me. Could you contain yourself for five minutes, Date? Never. <laughs> oh God damn it! Logo, plants. I do not see Date, this going well. Look, a cricket. A cricket? Look at you, Iba. Gamer, no. Dante, no. Gamer, no. Gamer, yes. <laughs> Iba has a strange fascination with insects. No, Gamer, continue. We will, we will all love you for it. This painting is called Hawaiian Dishes and Dark Demons. What? Which part is supposed to be a dish and which part is supposed to be a demon? No, seriously, what? <laughs> Oni pulls <laughs> Bar Lady, are you sure? We have some really good fish here, fresh from the hook. Uh... <laughs> Runs off crying. What <laughs> did I say? Something wrong? Oi. Incomprehensible abstra abstract painting on the wall. Oh, this is Dark Zoom Kalimas. Who? Heh. Dark Zone Kalimas. Okay. Many machine full of drinks. Magazines. How to draw cute anime girls. I think I'll give that a look. <laughs> high table, high stools. It's a high stool. Why are you always thinking about high school? What the? I said stool. What the hell, Mizuki? Blank monitor, sofas. <laughs> what? Captain. Enemy vessel, three clicks. Oh my god. I believe you are thinking of sonar. <laughs> do you have do you have English comprehension problems there, Dante? I I don't I don't I don't understand. Probably an office. Alright, let's talk to let's talk to Tits McGee over here. Uh things have been pretty serious around here lately. Yeah, totally. You never think about like my boss getting murdered, you know? Like, what are even the chances? That's like, the odds of hitting the lotto. But it was kind of lucky, in a weird way. Uh... Lady? Do you know who's standing in front of you? Some of my old friends hit me up asking about it, you know. Feels like we're old alumni or something. She certainly found the bright side of this situation. Clearly. You know the receptionist. I mean, yeah, but... Yeah, of course we know each other. We're like, best friends. Really? We I find that hard to we believe. Party. What? We do not party. You, you party with a 12-year-old? Ain't no party like a 12-year-old party because a 12-year-old party goes to bed by 8 o'clock? Hey, hey! What the fuck? She's a bimbo! Who hired this woman? I swear to God, if you say your dad. Receptions, my boss got killed. It's like winning the lottery. The most likely scenario is that the final decision was made by the head of the company. Renju. God damn it, Renju. All right, have you seen Iris? Iris? You mean Asa? She's recording a podcast in the underground studio. Oh, okay. Oh, that's why she didn't pick up the phone. If you need her, <laughs> you know, I can try no, it's fine. This can wait until she's See, done. this this is why, like, if I ever had any like political ambitions or anything like that, like I wanna I wanna like hold office, like you know, be the mayor of my town or something, I never could. Because all of the things I've said on the internet would Oh my god. Oh oh my god. You guys have like seen me at my worst. Ah, <laughs> uh, Code Vane? Yes, I know card I I I've seen Code Vane. For sure. For sure. What? For sure? As in, I got you? I don't believe I've ever heard that sequence of sounds spoken out loud before. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, what's gonna happen to the office? Oh, haven't heard anything about that yet. The VP might take over, we might get absorbed by another office. Just when I got a job, too. Man. What am I gonna do if this place closes up? 
Team G2020. So, anyway, tell me, Date, what kind of girls do you like? Where? Uh, because I'm the committed type, you know? Would you consider me a candidate? Really? Are you are you as committed to men as you are to those obviously fake implants you got going on there? Well, I... I... I could go out sometime. Wow, dude. <laughs> you disgust me. What the hell? Oh, uh, my apologies. Never mind. <gasps> Reception sitting behind the desk. There's a receptionist with huge breasts sitting behind the desk. There's a receptionist with huge breasts sitting. I love this. There's a receptionist with huge breasts. Huge breasts. Breasts. There are huge breasts sitting behind the desk. Oh, God. Oda. Have you seen Oda? Nah, no, I haven't seen him today. How is he? The receptionist knows Oda too? <laughs> Don't get into politics, man. Cancel culture would come for you faster than you could say come into me, Chris. Yeah, I know. Seriously. You're Oda not wrong. to be the kind of otaku who actually has social skills. <laughs> you can't even run for office, considering you're associated to my uh, tendency to say hot things. Yeah, th this is why like, I've, I've, I've come to accept my lot in life, fine. Those are the ones you have to watch out for. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> anyway, could you give me a call if Ota shows up? I have my number here. I took out my business card and handed it over to the receptionist. Yeah, I got his number. I got his number. Let us pray that the privilege will not be abused. Oh, boy. Great. Well, all right, then. Uh, Mizuki, let's get the hell out of here. Mizuki, let's go. Staying here would be a waste. Yeah. Where should we go next? Well, we really only have one other option, and that's Golden Yokocho. So let's uh let's head on over. <laughs> nothing ventured, nothing gained, I say. Oh jeez. Do 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 bum bum bum. Is this it? Yeah. You know about this place? Yeah. This is where I met Renju for the first time. Oh, really? Interesting. Interesting. Didn't think this was your kind of spot. This place is special. You can find all sorts of shady characters here. It's the best place for gathering information about a case. Hmm. What am I going to do when this place goes up? You can always come work at a, work at a gymnasium's PR department. This is what was person acts like when we were in our school type. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Oh dear. She's so painfully dumb, I think her brain fell into her chest. <laughs> so if this reception just turns out to be a major part of the plot later on. A major part of the plot or the, uh... Plot. I'll leave that to your imaginations. So that's why. That is only a partial truth. Shut up. Huh? Let's head inside. Alright, let's go. Where is everyone? Gamer no. <laughs> it's been Gamer like this yes. for a while. Not many people come here anymore. Mama should be here soon though. Okay. In other news, hmm. at 6.10 p.m. yesterday, on the outer circle of the capital city highway in Minato District, Tokyo, a traffic collision occurred involving five cars and at least one truck. Oh, lovely. MPD has arrested the driver of the truck suspected to be the cause of the accident for negligence. The investigation is ongoing. Okay, then. Good info. <laughs> Let's count them. Nine. Nine bottles. There are nine bottles on the counter. Just kidding. There are 18. That's how many? Let's count carefully. 18 bottles. Picture on the wall. It's a little odd. That is an odd photo. Hey, Mizuki. Do you mind cleaning some of your stuff out of the fridge at home? Not gonna happen. What the hell? It's my fridge. God damn it. Man, I could use a drink. No, 
You're driving. Can't you just drive? Indeed I can, but I refuse. Why? What the hell? Nothing good comes of you being drunk. Thanks, Iba. Posters, talented Mr. Dickley. The hell? I don't even want to know what that is. A sofa. A table. A menu. A blackboard. Slippers and tomato. Wait, excuse me. That doesn't sound that a that a that a appetizing. Is that just me? Oh, flyer. Iba's five. She legally can't drive. <laughs> uh, sober security, Iba, making sure Date stays sober. Date, what was that weird show you used to watch? The one with the girls running in slow motion. What was so good about it? Everything. <laughs> Date's a man of culture, guys. He's a man of culture. I don't want to get drunk. I just want to be sobriety impaired. Oh my god. Allow me to ruin your stupid joke before you say it. It's not stupid. <laughs> Those hangers are a little too high. Uh. Yeah. Kind of, I guess, yeah. It would be a little bit too high. Seems like perspective wasn't worked out uh, quite a bit. Wait, hold on, what's this? Nothing. Stool? Stool. Stool! Mizuki, are you tired? No. Like, neither of us have slept. And what do you mean by that? Nothing. Just let me know when you're tired. You can go home anytime you want. You aren't really worried about me. You just think I'm annoying, right? Don't beat around the bush. Just say it. But you know what? It wouldn't matter anyway because I'm not going home. Jeez, girl. All right, then. Music is sitting next to me. Uh, having fun in school? It's okay. Is it? Yup. <laughs> Do you have a lot of friends? Yeah. But I don't really like my elementary school friends. They're too immature. I have more fun with Iris and Ota. I don't know if they're too immature. You're just very mature for your age. You think so? The kids at school are so stupid. They gossip about who had their first kiss for days. I don't see why that's anyone's business. These grade schoolers move fast. Yeah. <laughs> no, not really. It's pretty normal nowadays. You... You haven't kissed anyone yet. Oh, Date, no. No, I'm not interested in that. Oh, thank God. No, oh, thank God. <laughs> Parent mode activated for a quick second there. It's been a long time since we did this. Did what? Sat at a table together like this. We haven't eaten dinner together in a while. After I finish working on this case, we should do it again. Why? Because of what happened to my mom and daddy? I don't need that. Date, Jeez. this is where you need to take a stronger role as her guardian. Data suggests that children who eat alone are prone to mental imbalances and poor physical condition. This is very much true. I'm very much a, a believer in that sort of thing. You always want to have, like, a uh, family dinner with, with your family at night. The meals you prepare do have sufficient nutritional content. However, you need to make sure that Mizuki is eating all of it. Otherwise, your effort is... Mom, I was right. We should have at least one meal together. I told you, I don't want to. Why not? Because... Um, I don't like how you hold chopsticks. It makes me sick. Really? <laughs> now? People have always told me that I have good technique. Some even say it's beautiful. Date, you're ruining it. You're, ruin you're, you're losing the plot, man. You're losing the plot. You're finding some other plot somewhere else. Maybe back at that receptionist desk. But it's not here. This ain't it, chief. It's disgusting. Too clean. Besides, there's no point in eating together. Why is that? Because you don't talk when you're eating. I don't like sitting in silence. Oh, we don't have to be quiet. It's fine. I don't like hearing you talk either. Oh my god. I believe she has entered her teenage rebellion phase a year early. Seriously? Oh, this is gonna be rough. <laughs> Welp, that's me. We all eat at different times. You're going back on that sushi offer then? All right, so about your dad. Hey, Date. What did you and Daddy used to talk about when you were here? Huh. 
I don't remember a lot of it. I was usually drinking pretty hard. Don't worry. I have everything recorded. In fact, Ooh. the conversation about you taking care of Mizuki took place here at Marble. Really? Really? The topic was brought up several times afterward, but the first time was here. Four years ago, after drinking enough liquid courage, Renju asked you to take care of Mizuki. At the time, hmm. Renju was recently divorced, buried in work at Lemnisgate, and mentally unstable. It was a display Yikes. of excellent judgment. It was a good thing that he managed to swallow his pride. You think so? Sometimes, I don't think it was the right move. You should have more confidence. I guarantee you that it was the best decision. Well, thanks, Iba. Let's hope so. Dante, oh. honey. Long time no see. Harvey Feinstein, is that you? Hey, Mama. How have you been? Oh, tired and sore, but not in a fun way. <laughs> Watch the innuendo in front of the kid. Oh, boy. Oh, who is this? It's Lala Chan, guys. Renju's daughter. Liquid Courage, is that what liquor is short for? No, it's not. It's just it's just another name for for liquor. Lala is cargo? Hi, nice to meet you. Oh, to make sure he's you're... eating all of her food. But I'm allergic to peanuts, and I'm allergic to girls. What the fuck? I... Oh, it must have been hard. I saw on the news. It's okay. Really. Oh, it must have been so hard. Hello, darkness, <laughs> my old friend. Yes, pretty much. Stupid Red. I've come to talk with you again. What was he thinking, leaving his little girl like this? Oh. <laughs> Hey, Mama. I wanted to ask you some questions about Renju. Oh. I guess crying isn't going to solve the thing, is it? Go ahead. Ask away. I'll help any way I can. Well, all right then. We shall uh we shall chat. Dear God. Um is Renju a regular here? I haven't seen him for a while. I thought I was going to shrivel up and die of boredom without you boys around. Shrivel up? You look like a purple water balloon. <laughs> That's right. Care to give me a poke? Nope. I'm out. I'm out. No. I am. I am. I am out. You can. You can. <laughs> Somebody, please. Knife me. Please. I'll pass. Thanks. I am out. How's business? Not bad. Hey, that's good. I want you to keep this place open as long as you can. It makes me feel sad and old when a place I used to visit closes down. Well, then you should visit more often. I could hook you up in more ways than one. Where? Just the one way is fine. Thanks. Okay, I'm, I'm good. Yeet! Yeet! Ye ye I'm out. So glad I recorded sounds for your soundboard. Oh my god! <laughs> Have you heard any rumors about Renju? Anything about grudges? Disputes? Is it okay to talk in front of Mizuki? Yes, I want to be here. Trust me, you couldn't drag her away. Lala-chan. If you say so. Apparently, Ren had some connections with the Kumakura gang. Oh? A gang? Yeah, real rough customers. This is their turf. So Daddy was involved with gangsters. Mizuki. That company Shoko was running. Were they also tied to the Kumakuras? Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. Don't think it, I have no idea. I'll ask her one day when the time is right. Are you scared of Mama? Not really. Mama looks like a trustworthy woman. You can give her a poke, TMG. Do. Oh, don't worry, honey. I don't bite. I'm only aggressive when it comes to men 20 through mm, 65. Fuck. That's a pretty wide range. Yes, yeah, seriously. Gotta widen my net for a catch like you, Date, honey. Oh, righty then. <laughs> I think I'll ignore that one. I think I'll ignore it as well. <laughs> This is your first time at a place like this, Mizuki? Yeah, I mean, at some fish pocket they served alcohol, but I've never been to a bar like this. I would hope. Is Apollo Justice's bracelet reacting again? 
Well, Daddy invited me along sometimes, but I was too shy to go. Good call. <laughs> I was planning on going one day when I was old enough to drink. I wanted to go to a bar with Daddy. Oh, and now you can't. I heard that shady characters hang out here. So who are you and how do you fit in? Why do we bring Mizuki here again of all places? She didn't want to leave. She, 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 she wants to be on the case. No one special. I'm just a facilitator. F facilitator of what? A facilitator? People who come in here tend to have very specific interests. I help accommodate. Oh, okay. Mama's like, uh, an informant. That's right. And I won't charge you this time. Just promise to get the bastards who did this to Ren for me. All right, I will. This is for him. I promise. Curling up a little. She's she's intimidated. The bar counter. Oh, can I look at all of these things again? This is a painting of Saint Sebastian. Saint Sebastian. Saint Sebastian was a faithful Christian who lived under Roman Emperor Diocletian. I couldn't even recognize that as Saint Sebastian, but I think she's right. On January twentieth, two eighty-eight A.D. Yeah. He was martyred. This painting depicts his execution. Something wrong, Dante? You're staring awful hard. Why do you have a picture of Saint Sebastian? Nothing. Just caught my eye. Why now, of all times? That's been hanging there for a while. Really? Yeah. It was a gift from Ren a while back. Excuse me? I've always had it there. It's a gift from Renju. 